Hey there, YouTube, and welcome back to Millennial Gameplay. Last time on Crash Bandicoot, we went through quite a few different levels and got a few gems here and there, and we defeated Dr. Nitrous Brio. This time, we're going to start things off by going into the lab. So I'm going to say right off the bat, this level in particular is a little tricky. You want to try your best. Like, it is straightforward, but you want to try and best to take stock of what's going on around you, what timing you should have, and real quick, I'm going to explain that. You have three seconds right there. I just counted it out. So, generally speaking, you're going to want to do it then, because the timing of the electric shocks are, while not exactly similar to the floor tiles, it's enough to where you can use it while the electric shocks are going off. Now, when I said it was tricky, I really don't know. You're gonna love this one. Yeah, just doing that. That is so evil, but I love it. I love that they did that. I did not remember that beforehand. That was just something that happened around I just like I got killed by that in my test run through. It was really funny to me, honestly. Oh yeah. Alright, so this is gonna be a tad challenging. Come on, stop pushing out. God damn it. Okay. I'll catch you guys whenever I like I'm gonna edit all this out real quick. I'll catch you guys whenever I get the fucking box up there. There we go. Alright, now I just have to get through the rest of this without losing. Alright, and there she goes. It's a shame, though. I lost my extra hit. There's a strong possibility that I will die just because the bonus level is as it is. These guys. These guys. I got scared. I got really scared. If you time it right, you can hit him literally every time, so he'll be stunned while he's electrocuting. But if you touch him while he's electrocuting, straight fucked. Like, it is straight up the worst. And if since I don't have an extra hit, it's a little bothersome, to say the least. Okay, so that one does the floor that one. So instead, I should do it backwards. Wait, no, I did it. I timed it wrong. Give me a second here, guys. Alright. Oh! Damn it. I didn't even see that guy, game. How is that a fair way to die? Wait, the floor. Yep, you can still cheese things. It's, it's still possible to go around some of these floors. I okay. Glad I could be, uh, you know, here for that game. Just like fantastic, good, good, solid work. Glad that this is the last colored gem level. This is like uh, I'm so happy right now hear it in my voice, can't you, viewers? Like, my, I'm, I'm ecstatic, as it were.
Yeah, that door in particular. As long as you're ahead of it, it won't close again. Preemptive jump. There we go. But wait! You fucked it up. Now here's the thing. We've already, like, this is the last technical level. And, as you can see, you can't go through it as Coco. We've already gone through all the levels that have gems. In them. So I'm gonna go ahead and go back. I'm gonna... Go ahead and grab the yellow gem, grab the purple gem, and then I will see you guys back at the other two places. I'll just show, like, quick clips and stuff like that of me getting these two gems. I'll catch you guys back at where the gem paths are. Man, that took me a lot more tries than I care to admit. I even went and got out two extra hits, and I didn't even use them on the last attempt. So, you know, wasted my own time. Huh. So they kept that in. Be sure to keep that in editing. Holy crap, that's a free exit? <laughs> that's so cool. All right. All right, with those done, we have actually achieved every single colored gem possible we are only missing two gems i say i'm gonna go ahead and get them in the next video and then show off the secret exit of the next video or the secret ending of the next video and spoiler alert yeah there are secret endings to these games that's that what they did back in uh, the 90s whenever you 100 percented something they would give you a little extra so next time on crash bandicoot we'll be going through the Great Gate, and I believe it's uh, Boulder Dash. And then we'll be done with the game, essentially. See you guys then.